Well, yeah. Interesting, to say the least, from this new rocket. Yeah, uh, Freddy was very vocal about wanting to change things up and, you know, how he didn't really feel he was doing that. Low is when that minion wave is taken in the top. Yeah. Because that's like three, four minion uh, waves there. Airwax actually coming in here, just get the steal off. Shock is taking a bunch of damage, being chased down. And Sophia coming in with the package as well, jumping along with the Valkyrie, jumps away to the minions, just trying to farm before he goes down. Shock will be the first blow of the game. Yeah that every single game it's more of an exit objective like Dragon right now it's like if you yep. take an objective you can go for Herald or you get a kill you can go for Herald if you just have spare time. In, a, in an open split push scenario here we may see a big fight here with the package with the Zachary keep your eyes on it. Well, Betsy coming in, Kavashar taking a lot of chunk damage, he doesn't have Zanus just yet, but Hanan is there to fight him. Alex coming over the wall, has been hooked in by Kasing, joins the rest of his team, but he's getting chunked down by Betsy. And Airwax picks up the kill there, Nuke Duck now having to back off into the river, and it's now... Here, based immediately, get a good 2 man package right here. Betsy flying from the side, he took out Kavashar, I believe his cleanse was prematurely, this is why he did not get out of the cannon stomach, but overall, another kill, another dragon here for Rocket. Another red buff steal, and maybe even the mid lane tower. Rockhead playing fantastic. Yeah, and Betsy's found Nuke Duck in the middle lane as well. Will flash away, but gets him with a final overload. Sophia just maturely. They're not really split pushing, so they're actually allowing Vitality to get back into the game. Yeah, and as you were saying on the analyst desk as well, Rockhead doesn't need to do crazy things. They don't need to be SKT. They can go with the simple strategies. Kabashar can't hold him away. Freddy in the top lane jumps on Kjarnan. It's actually a lot of damage. Remember, he's building full tanks, so he's not going to end the first off. But they found the Dazzle once again, and the Dazzle Man locks him down and secures yet another kill for oh. We've seen this in Challenger series before, actually. We had a jungler who oh. would build a Black Cleaver and just split push all day. I believe it was Dan. But Edward coming in here. There's the Dazzle. Chasing him down, but the teleport now coming in as well by Kavashot. Doesn't have the extra movements before. Flash into the enemy team, and Freddy taking a bunch of damage, but he still has his passive airwax. And the bottom lane as well is just being slowly chunked away and Vitality, if they want to stop this, they just have to hard engage, but previously that hasn't gone very well. Airwax not even hooked in the top 2500 actually on the side of Rockat, so not too bad. Yeah, 2.5k, lowest Baron power play of the day, below the server split average, but honestly it doesn't matter, they got an inhibitor. Probably this low because they already had so much I think he can do. Airwax is split, but Kavashar is going to deal with him, just breaking open the base here. Airwax doesn't actually go for the tower. Look at top, look at top right now. now the Flash is the no package, so he can't get in there super quickly, but the top tower goes down. Airwax just took a Nexus turret. This is kind of the chance, like, everyone is kind of stuck in this Baron pit for Freddy going for this fight. Jumps in, there's the flay, knocks him backwards. Kionin gets deleted before the fight really begins. Kavashot in the back lines, lots of damage coming in, but it's not quite enough to finalize a kill. Finally gets the kill onto Sophia, and Edward is now dropping low, but it doesn't matter. They pick up the three kills onto Vitality. Shook now running away with his tail between his legs, but Freddy now teleporting into this space. This could be curtains for Vitality. Yeah, good setup. Lantern gets thrown in to teleport into the back line from Kabushar with the home guards, but it's too little too late. By the time he arrives, Yarnan's already down. Betsy, Freddy, Edward and Erex looking to finish the game. No back to delivery. Right now, because is dead. Yeah, unfortunate. But 20 seconds remaining on Hiana. They can't defend. Rockat closing in to close in with the win. The curtain call comes down. And Rockat bring this one home. 8-1 in kills. And the first win on the board. He went smooth than the celebration. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, very I have to, impressive. From I have Rocket, to eat my man. words, man. Oh. I think we all do. That was.